Don't forget, if you like art and you want to show it, uh, pick up a Halloween drawing sticker. Uh, these are only going to be around till October 31st, 2022. Uh, and then after that, I'm going to take them away forever. Uh, so pick one up before then. I put these on water bottles. I put these on, you know, on my laptop. I put them all over the place. Uh, but definitely pick one up if you like showing your spirit. Anyways, let's get back into the lesson. Hey, how's it going? Uh, today we're going to go over how to draw a fire skull. It's going to be simple, easy for beginners. So let's get started uh, and jump right in. <laughs> I'm going to go right here and I'm going to start kind of toward the bottom of the page. Um, and I'm going to go over here and I'm going to go up in up over here over here down up down line over here on the inside of the eye line over here on the inside of the eye again this would be you know this is the eye socket right but it's still going to be you know shaped the more stylistic curve curve going to go over here curve underneath Curve underneath. Let me know what you're gonna dress like for Halloween. I'm curious. Uh, for me, I'm going to dress like, I think like a vampire. I believe this year. I don't really have much. <laughs> I think I think vampire is gonna be it. Uh, I'm gonna fill those in, by the way, those shapes. But my marker's kind of dying out, so let me use this other marker. I'm just gonna fill those shapes in. Be careful, do this in a ventilated area, maybe have a fan on, because these markers smell bad. It's bad to inhale this stuff. Like, uh, curve, curve. Gonna go over here. Line underneath, line underneath for the eye, line underneath for this eye, line underneath for this eye. Line up, line up. Curve up here, curve up here. I'm gonna go over here around the temple area right there and put like a L shape right here. Same shape on the other side. Out, down, curving in, down for the cheekbone. Out, down, curving in, down here for this this side of the cheekbone. Kind of goes really, it sinks in really deep there, I noticed. So. See, now you get like this angry pair of eyes. Um, don't forget, if you like this kind of stuff, hit the subscribe, click the bell notification. I'm gonna be putting up uh, three lessons every day until uh, until Halloween day, pretty much. So definitely, definitely, definitely do that. Um, it's also gonna subscribe you for next year because uh, when you subscribe and click the bell notification, uh, when I start posting videos in a year, right next year, you're gonna be like, oh cool, it's gonna be showing up in your feed again. Uh, you're like, oh, what was the name of that channel? So it's good for that. Getting a pull line down. Line down over here for kind of the uh, <coughs> the side of the mouth there. Downward here up. Line across. Downward here up. Go over here. Curve up right here for for that area. Curve over here for you know for the teeth. And then I'm gonna pull uh, kind of these lines like that for the row, rest of the row of teeth. Line right here for the nasal cavity. I'm going to put the top there. Down, in, up. Curve over here on that side. I'm going to fill that shape in as well to get this nasal cavity in there. Gonna pull a line up over here, up over here, because he's kind of angry, right? He's, you know, folding lines right there. These lines are thinner, by the way. These crunchy lines, they're thinner because you want it to be detail oriented. <laughs> line, 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 line. Curve, curve. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna draw the flame on the top of the head, okay? So I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna curve one area right there. Down, pulling up. Down over here, 
pulling over here, pulling down, pulling up, and go back down here, right? So those are, there's uh, my only rhyme or reason on that was I wanted to make them different sizes. So obviously that one's bigger, this one's smaller, and I wanted to make it a little bit off off balance because I want it to be more natural. So for example, over here, I'm gonna go on this side, throw another little flame right there, like there's an actual like flame coming off. That off balanceness makes it look more natural, and that's kind of what I like about it. Um, but yeah, you know, that's it's got that, that fiery glow, that fiery look. You could just curve over here, you could leave it in. I'm gonna leave it in like that. Like it's kinda like merging in. I'm gonna kinda trace the the shape of it as well over here. <coughs> just to kinda make it look more fiery. Um, I'm gonna give that shape as well, kind of a 3D-ness to it. Right, to kind of get that going. And then um, I'm gonna fill that in as well. I'm gonna fill that in to kind of give it a little bit of a stronger stylistic uh, look. Don't forget, buy a sticker if you have, uh, like I'm gonna, those stickers are gonna be gone after about a month. They're gonna be gone forever. So definitely buy a sticker uh, right now. Um, they're fun to have around. Uh, definitely, definitely a great time. All right. And I guess I could throw it in the actual flame here a little bit, just a little bit. Line, 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 line. Just kind of doing those little lines right here as a stylistic thing. Um, doesn't have to be, you know, the best thing ever, but you know, just throwing it in there, just to kind of give it a little bit more flavor. And you can kind of throw them around here. I want to thank you very much. If you did like this video, the channel's growing uh, very, very rapidly. So uh, definitely hit the share if you want to help the channel out. It's amazing for you to do that. Uh, I've been doing this for seven years, and I'm just getting started, I feel. I feel like I'm just getting really into it now. So thank you so much, and I'll talk to you in the next video, okay? Say hi to me in the comments if you reached this long, and uh, happy Halloween.